The triple helix model has been used to explain the interaction between universities, industry, and government in order to foster innovation and economic growth. This paper examines the evolution of the triple helix model and its implications for global economic development. It argues that the triple helix model must evolve in order to remain relevant in today's rapidly changing global environment. The authors argue that the triple helix model should be viewed as a dynamic process rather than a static structure, and that it must adapt to the unique characteristics of each region or nation. They also suggest that the triple helix model should focus more on the geographic level of analysis, as opposed to the national level. This article was authored by Helen Lawton-Smith and Loet Laidsdorf.